Sources telling CNN that the Swedish government is negotiating the release of three Americans still detained in North Korea. Now, they say that the Swedes haven't given a deadline to the North Koreans, but they are pointing out that this could be crucial ahead of a proposed high-stakes meeting between President Trump and Kim Jong-un, proposed for May. Tony Kim and Kim Hak Sung were detained in 2017. Both were affiliated with an elite university in Pyongyang. Kim Dong Chul was sentenced to 10 years of hard labor for espionage. Of course, the tension on this issue has been extremely high since Otto Wombier, the U.S. student who was detained for a very long time, was returned to the U.S. and died just a few days later. And the shuttle diplomacy continues. A key representative of North Korea is on his way to Finland, according to Finnish officials. He will be meeting there with the South Korean officials and Americans unaffiliated with the U.S. government. That could be the key next step into making the Trump-Kim Jong-un meeting actually happen. David McKenzie, CNN Seoul.